Okay, go. Hello, everyone, and welcome. I am here with Kelsey Delamar. She is our main actress. She is the bomb. She is playing Ariana in the movie Unfailing Love. So welcome, welcome, and thank, thank you. you so much for being in it. Thank you. I want to just start out and say that this young lady, had she exceeded my expectations. So I had an idea for Ariana, I had an idea for the movie, but you took that thing from zero to a hundred and I want to publicly say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So tell us a little bit about yourself and how you got into acting. Okay. Well, I actually started acting when I was about 10 years old. Um, I was living in Tennessee. Well, actually nine because we moved at 10. I was living in Tennessee. And my teacher told my mom about this art school that she thinks I should go to. And my mom was looking into it and, you know, it wasn't cheap and she was a single parent, but she believed in me. And ever since 10, I've only gone to art schools. I mostly did theater though growing up, so film is totally different. Okay. But I started doing theater, um, started doing musical theater, started loving music. And yeah, it's been about been over a decade for sure. Okay. <laughs> Definitely over a decade. Okay, good. And so you sing and dance? Do you dance? I did. So I started in dance with um, in Tennessee. I did like tap, ballet, jazz, like all all the bases. And I carried it into Maryland when I went to Baltimore School for the Arts. But when I moved to California for um, attending California Institute of the Arts, I had to choose just one. I couldn't choose dance and acting or music okay. and dance okay. so I just stuck with acting at CalArts and I was still able to you know make music and I took some dance elective classes but I focused on mostly acting okay. Okay. and so speaking of um, music and acting and, and all that the, I have to tell y'all this little um, funny story so she came in I had written the character of Ariana to be a vegetarian and to be a creative person. And so she came in and she was like, oh, I'm a vegetarian, I eat this, this, and this, you know, because we were fixing everybody's meals. And I'm thinking to myself, oh, she in character. Like, she <laughs> is serious about this crap. <laughs> and you're actually a vegan. <laughs> yep, yep. <laughs> So I'm thinking she's all into her character, but she's, and so to me that says that you were supposed to be Ariana in the first place. Yeah. And then even writing in the script how you mentioned, I wrote in there that you were to tell him that you were the creative type, and you actually are the creative type. Yeah. <laughs> so it was like, wow, you actually, so what, besides those things, was there anything else that that you saw in that character for yourself. Oh yes, um, poor Ariana. <laughs> she went through so much, but it resonated with me because I went through a lot. And one thing I will say is her going back to like a familiar person or what she knew, what she thought was love, just because like he was like her first love. I resonated with that so much. I did because it's like I. When I was analyzing her as a character, I try to always analyze my characters with non-judgmental eyes. Cause I'm like, why, why does she keep doing this? Why? And I was like, well, you weren't too far off yourself. You know, I had my first love. Um, was not the healthiest relationship, but because it was the first, it's like you kept going back to it. You kept going back to it. You kept giving chances after chances, and I just like that was one part of her that I was like, dang girl, I wish you could see like the love that you truly deserve and I don't know she 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 definitely touched my heart that's good and what about mommy your... sorry 